Hello everyone, welcome back to The Walking Dead Season 2. We're going to do some Episode 4 today, but before I do that, I would like to have a quick discussion on Episode 3 and how it disappointed me in many, many ways. So, Episode 3, they had this problem where none of the choices you made seemed to have affected anything. They all got the same result, like, immediately. Which I get that they're supposed to kind of get the same result later on, but they're supposed to be different after you make the choice. And in, this, in episode 3, that just didn't happen. Like, no matter what, Reggie died. Whether you helped Sarah or not. Uh, no matter what, Kenny got his ass beaten by Carver. Because um, even if you choose to take blame, he takes the radio from you. Like, it just seemed like none of the choices you made mattered. Except for the last one. So I'm really hoping that they don't do that in this one. I'm really, really hoping. Because the last one disappointed me a lot. So anyway, let's go ahead and play it. We'll find out, I guess. Yeah, the last choice probably. I should shut up for this. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge. Now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> Fucker. Yeah, no matter what that happens. Cover yourself in their smell. Rub the walker guts all over you. I can't tell you from one of them. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Go on. You don't need to see this. I'm not going anywhere. Maybe that decision might have some kind of an impact later on, but I I don't I don't know that it will. This choice, though, right here, you get to choose whether to cut the, uh, hit the zombie or to hit her arm. If you know anything about zombies, you should know to cut off her arm. I imagine she'll probably end up dying later on, nonetheless. Maybe she can't defend herself because she doesn't have an arm, but at least that will have some last through an additional episode. Oh, fuck you! See, this is what I was talking about. Did I literally not just talk about this? I was convinced that that would have some kind of last. Okay, she's still alive. No, uh, yeah, see, she's gonna die anyway, though. It really doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. Wow. Even the final choice doesn't matter. We have to leave. Jesus. Ax Serena, yes! Yes! We're gonna kill her. Oh! <laughs> yeah, it had to be done. Kenny, you know that. Kenny, you know that. You, do? you know that. What the hell is going on? Why? Why? She won't suffer now. We have to go. Stop it, fucking kid. Kenny. I like how all the zombies are just completely ignoring us right now. They just don't care. I was convinced that at least that final decision would have some impact, but it really didn't, did it? It really didn't matter. It really didn't matter. Oh, shit. Ah, fucking quick time events. Okay. I forgot that quick time events were a thing in this game. You'll have to forgive me. That is infuriating. Are they having, like, a budget issue or something? Why can't they make the, uh, decisions last? Shit. Come here. There we go. Alright, quick time event. I'm gonna fuck you up. Ah, fuck you. Don't do that. I like how they just left me here. A little girl, they just left me here. Great. I got that quick time event locked down. 
This could actually be a good thing, assuming it's dead. They leave me alone. Or not. You know, sure. I like how half the zombies look the same. I guess you're not really supposed to be pay paying attention to the background zombies, but yeah, they, they almost all look the same. Look at them. There's two on screen. Yeah, like, all of them look the same. This is ridiculous. Keep quiet. Keep quiet. You don't want to speak. Attract some, some asshole over here. Ah, it's you. Preggers. She's going to be all pregnant this episode. She's going to go into labor. You're very welcome. You know, there's not an opening there. Shit. Over there. There's pretty much no such thing as an opening in this. Oh, hello. Yes, we will. She is, you fucking idiot. We can't come together like this. It's better if we spread out. You two will be fine. No, you don't understand. Just... No, we gotta spread out. You think we should spread out? We'll spread out. You said you would stay with me. Dude, you need to get your shit together. You need to get your shit together right now. You're gonna get us all killed. Damn it. We'll have to push through that cluster of walkers. There's too many. We'll make a cow catcher. Just we need. Okay. Just tell me what to do. Yeah. I'm on your page. There. That one looks light enough to carry. I'm gonna get on the far side of that. I need you to get her attention. A cow catcher. <laughs> Nailed it. Oh, it's one of these. Now, are you? Follow me. Stay close. If you fall behind, I can't come back for you. Or maybe. You can't. You came back before. Why can't you do it again? See, now they're like way more uh, dense. They weren't this dense a second ago. Okay, I'm holding down the button as hard as I can. I should not be falling behind. Clementine, get your shit together. We could still use that. They're still pretty close. Let's go. We could still have used that. How do they still have ammo? Do they just not even reload? They just don't reload. All right. Episode 4, Amid the Ruins. Cool. Hopefully we uh, come across anyone else. Because, I mean, I have to say, this chick, that chick right there, not my favorite. The other one's not bad, but she's kind of weird. Where's Kenny? Where's Luke? Where are the good characters? You need to keep up, bitch. Keep going. I mean, we're almost there, right? I hope so. It's getting so damn cold. Wish I could stop, but I can't. Not until we're with the others. I need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God damn it. What if they aren't there? What if? If they aren't, nothing we can do about it. Don't even say things like that. Fine. You're being realistic, Jesus. Jesus. I don't even know if we're safe. 
What if the herd is still following us? Yeah, we're moving faster than them. It's been quiet, but who knows? We gotta keep going. It's been at least an hour since I saw any walkers. Oh wow, we're Herders good then. People should be keeping them busy for a while. Better be lucky. I know I should feel glad that we escaped. But I just can't stop thinking about the others. Dude, you need to shut up, though. It was stupid. You've been talking for an hour straight. Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out. But maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If you can the plan did working, work. We could have... I don't know. It worked. The plan worked. We got out of there. Most of us. Look, I know that some of your people didn't make it. But Carver was crazy. Staying would have only prolonged the inevitable. Damn I'm straight. just saying that if people hadn't panicked, things might have turned out better. Of course. We panicked. We were scared. The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... <sighs> She's going to go through labor in this episode, isn't she? I'm sorry. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Dude, we've got like an hour. We've been walking for an hour. We're way ahead of the zombies. I think we'll be fine. We were walking at a pretty brisk pace there. Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. <laughs> Thanks to that fucking madman. Just gonna let them uh, Just, discuss. Uh, how pregnant are you? <laughs> I'm gonna be stuck out here. How pregnant are you? Look at her. She looks like she has a fucking basketball in there. Look at that. Pretty fucking pregnant. What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just making conversation. It was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. You and Clem won't be able to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out well, here. Uh, I'm not helping her. It's going to need food. And, you know... Other stuff. Yeah. And? And? I'm not helping her raise that child. Don't put that on me. Don't They're put words in my mouth. things in this world. And you can't always protect them. Can't even protect your own fucking husband. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey! I've seen it before. Back when it started. Me and my sister, we what? were... She died? I don't need your pity. You don't. You don't have the right. Jane. Shit, I didn't mean it. Shit. Uh, Jane, wait. Jane, wait. Uh, come back. I like I like you more than her. Don't don't leave me with this weird gigantic person. And her child. Which, for some reason, people are saying I should take I care of. Sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. 